How to fix HMA Pro VPN connection issues. If you are experiencing any connection issues while using HMA VPN, you're in the right place. HMA donkeys have put together this article where, no matter what operating system you're using, you'll find your answer and resolve any connectivity issues. Select a tab below depending on which operating system you're using and please follow the steps in order. There are a few things you can try, which solve most problems. However, please let us know in the comment section, or via email, if you have never been able to connect at all. Windows, Vista slash 7 slash 8 slash 10 11, there are a few things you can try, which solve most problems. However, please let us know in the comment section, or via email, if you have never been able to connect at all. 1. Connect to several different VPN servers, the problem could be with one server. 2. Try both TPTP and OpenVPN registered protocols. You will find the PPTP and OpenVPN registered protocols on the dashboard screen under protocol selection. 3. If you have any firewall and antivirus programs installed, temporarily disable them and try to connect again. Firewalls and antivirus programs are the common cause for stopping VPN connections from working. 4. Uninstall HMA Pro VPN software, reboot your computer and reinstall, this could clear the issue. If none of these solutions help, please try to connect again, and if the problem persists click the open lock file or export lock button, along with the diagnostics button located in the bottom right hand corner of the HMA VPN diagnostics tab, in the dashboard, as shown in the image, alternatively you can set up manual connection, which are system built in, Windows Vista slash 7 slash 8 PPTP connection setup. Mac OS X, please carry out the following suggestions in order to resolve any connection issues you may have on your Mac OS X1. Connect to several different VPN servers, the problem could be with one server. See the image below on how to quickly change your VPN server, too. Try both PPTP and OpenVPN registered protocols. You will find the PPTP and OpenVPN registered protocols on the dashboard screen under protocol selection, 3. If you have any firewall and antivirus programs installed, temporarily disable them and try to connect again. Firewalls and antivirus programs are the common cause for stopping VPN connections from working. 4. Uninstall our software, reboot your computer and reinstall, this could clear the issue. If none of these solutions help, please try to connect again, and if the problem persists click the open lock file or export lock button, along with the diagnostics button located in the bottom right hand corner of the HMA VPN diagnostics tab, in the dashboard, as shown in the image, alternatively you can set up manual connection, which are system built in, Mac OS X manual connection setup. Linux, if you cannot connect to the VPN using your Linux system, we recommend that you try the following steps, 1, in case you use PPTP or L2TP connections, via terminal or network manager, make sure that you're using your special PPTP password. It can be found by logging into the VPN control panel and clicking on view under manually set up VPN, no software. 2. If you connect using the use the open VPN register protocol, via terminal or network manager, ensure that you're using your main HMA account password. 3. Try to connect to several different VPN servers using all available protocols. 4. If you can connect to the VPN, but you cannot browse, check your DNS settings and apply OpenDNS or Google DNS servers to your network adapter. There are two ways to change your DNS settings, changing the slash etc slash resolve.conf file, open the terminal, and type the following commands, sudo echo name server 208.67.222.222 slash etc slash resolve.conf sudo echo name server 208.67.220.220 slash etc slash resolve.conf You can also use a text editor such as Vim, Nano, or Emacs to change the servers, in this case just input name server 208.67.222.222 and name server 208.67.220.220 to the file. Changing the settings via Network Manager, you can follow this guide which applies to most Linux operating systems with Network Manager, https colon slash slash support dot open dns dot com slash entry slash 3804281 hyphen Ubuntu. 5. If you experience short or unstable connections, there might be an issue with a firewall on your system. Try temporarily disabling the firewall by entering the following set of commands in your terminal, sudo iptables f sudo iptables x sudo iptables p input drop sudo iptables p output accept sudo iptables p forward drop sudo iptables a input ilo j accept sudo iptables a input m state state related established j accept vpn routers, if your vpn router was successfully working before and you were enjoying hma vpn, but now your vpn router fails to connect or reconnect please continue. Reading. Follow the steps below that should resolve any connection issues you may be experiencing with your vpn router. 1. If you are trying to connect via PPTP slash L2TP, make sure that you are using your special password. Your special PPTP slash L2TP password can be found by logging into the VPN control panel. Copy your PPTP slash L2TP password from that page into the password field. 2. Try switching between protocols, PPTP slash L2TP, and try to connect again. 3. You may also want to try connecting to a different VPN server location. 4. Try to disable your router firewall for a moment and reconnect. 
NAS device. If your NAS device was previously fully working and you were able to successfully establish a VPN connection but now your NAS fails to connect or reconnect please follow our basic fixes. 1. If you are trying to connect via PPTP slash L2TP, make sure that you are using your special password. Your special PPTP slash L2TP password can be found by logging into the VPN control panel. Copy your PPTP slash L2TP password from that page into the password field. 2. Try switching between protocols, PPTP slash L2TP slash OpenVPN registered, and try to connect again. 3. You may also want to try connecting to a different VPN server location. 4. Try to disable your router firewall for a moment and reconnect. Visit our tutorial on the Synology NAS setup for all three protocols with supporting images to help you out. Advanced, all operating systems if you're frequently disconnected from the VPN, this can be due to a number of reasons. On this page we'll summarize the reasons and solutions for this issue. Connection issues are usually restricted to specific connection methods, clients, protocols, so trying alternative options can improve the situation. When experiencing e.g. unstable connections or other connection issues, the first things you should try are, when using HMA VPN client, switch VPN protocol between OpenVPN registered and PPTP in our client software and try enabling the auto path feature. Try several VPN servers from different areas. Disable all secured, computer temporarily, firewalls, especially the Windows firewall, antivirus software, peer blocking tools. Try using a different VPN. Diagnostics, if the problem remains. If the problem remains, the next things to try are, trying alternative VPN protocols, open VPN registered UDP, try open VPN registered via UDP with our alternative clients, e.g. Windows, open VPN registered GUI, Linux, OAST open VPN registered GUI, Mac OS X, Tunnel Lick. You can also try alternative VPN client applications, Windows dash open VPN registered GUI, Dialer, Mac dash Tunnel Lick, Linux dash HMA script, G open VPN registered. Manual connection PPTP slash L2TP, when connecting using a manual PPTP or L2TP connection on any operating system or device, please check for the following things, check if you are using the correct username plus password. Do not use your email address as your username. Do not use your account password, use your PPTP password. Not your account password. It can be found by logging into the VPN control panel and clicking on view under manually set up VPN, no software. Other operating systems and devices, HMA VPN can be used on numerous operating systems and devices. In case of connection problems, please try alternative VPN servers, protocols, open VPN registered TCP, open VPN registered UDP, PPTP, L2TP, and client applications frequent disconnect ions, if you are getting disconnection from the VPN frequently, this can have numerous reasons. On this page we'll summarize reasons and solutions for this issue. When experiencing this, first things you should do are, switch VPN protocol between open VPN registered and PPTP in our client software, Try several VPN servers from different areas, disable all security related software on your computer temporarily, firewalls, especially the Windows firewall, antivirus software, peer blocking tools, tips and tweaks, background apps and firewalls, note that especially on Windows, the cause is often applications or services running in the background which cause conflicts or simply block access. For example, file sharing applications or any other software that can create a high number of connections, might cause disconnect ions. A common issue, as mentioned, is the Windows firewall. Many users forget to disable the Windows firewall after they install an additional firewall, like Komodo, Zonalarm, or McAfee. Some antivirus applications also contain firewall functionality, so make you disable the Windows firewall when using any of these, having multiple firewalls installed creates a bunch of different problems. Unnecessary protocols and adapters, another common reason for connection issues on Windows is that applications install additional protocols into the properties of your network connection, example image. You should disable all unneeded protocols and services here, e.g. QoS, Topology, VMware, etc. Usually only TCP slash IPv4 is needed. Also check for installed network adapters that you don't use. If you're connected by a WLAN and do not use your LAN adapter, disable it. 
WLAN quality, if you're connected to your router via WLAN, the cause of disconnect lines of VPN can of course also be a bad WLAN signal strength, or other WLAN signals that are sent on the same channel. Solution for this would be changing your WLAN channel in your router settings, and also trying different values for other available settings, channel width, network mode, etc. Note that devices like microwaves, mobile phones etc. can also interfere with wireless connections. Also, is WLAN really necessary for you? Try wired setup to compare the connection quality. Interrupted downloads, to prevent downloads within your browser from getting interrupted when the connection is lost, you might want to use a download manager. This allows you to resume interrupted downloads. A good one is eg get right, but you can also use browser add-ons for this purpose, like flashkit, firefox. Tweaking network settings, on windows it makes sense to optimize TCP and network related settings with tools like TCP optimizer, which can improve not only your speed but also the stability of your connection. You can either do some fine tuning with each setting and check the effect, or just select your bandwidth and set the profile to optimal. Check our article Speed Troubleshooting for more info about this.